Hello everyone out there in Tableau land, people of the internet, uh, and everybody that's watching this video. So I wanted to make a video today. I'm in here catching up on some Tableau work, really getting excited for the, uh, the free e-learning platform that's going to pop up on Monday. Watch for that announcement. Um, I will blow that up on YouTube, on LinkedIn. We'll see if I delve into the uh, morass that is X, Twitter, whatever. Uh, Instagram, all those other trash platforms. But today I wanted to talk about building a network. Everybody knows a favorite topic of mine, but building a network in the context of this challenge, in the context of a shared love for data and this platform, Tableau. Um, so there are a ton of people out there studying Tableau working on Tableau and, and doing work with it. And so this is something that you can connect with people on. A lot of people out there will kind of, um, they don't know how to network and, and they'll sort of flail with it. They'll be directionless. Uh, they just go, they do a quick search on LinkedIn and they say, you know, here's 10 people that look like likely candidates and they click connect, connect, connect. And there's nothing to it. There's no message there. They're not creating a touch point. There's no common ground and they get frustrated when either the people don't connect with them or if they do connect, that connection is not productive. You know, they, they, they then ask, you know, do you know any jobs? And the people are like, yeah, yeah. You need to create a touch point with people and you need to have some sort of common ground, something, something in common with them, something to establish the relationship on. Oftentimes that can be, hey, we, I see we both went to the University of Maryland. Uh, go Terps, fear the turtle, whatever. Um, I see we're both from Ohio. I see we're both, you know, we both served in the Marine Corps, Semper Fi. Whatever that touch point is, you have to create some some sort of interest, some sort of investment. Hey, we're, we're, we both love the same thing, whatever that thing is. And that thing can be the that you're both studying Tableau or you're both in a Tableau user group or, or something like that. So let's go through some of the community aspects of this challenge. Um, and I've got one other thing I want to address before we get off. Just I just want to make sure that this challenge is as inclusive of everybody as possible. Okay, so let's bring this up. There we go. I make it big. I, I hate that there's no like in between option. Like that feels too small, and that feels too big. Anyway, now nah, let's make it big. Y'all don't need to see me that that in in high res. Okay, I feel like it's kind of meta that I'm creating a YouTube video while looking at my YouTube channel, but part of the challenge is the creation of content. I believe in the creation of content for everybody. I think that that's a good thing if you're developing your brand, even if it's even if it's just a personal professional brand, you don't want to become a, an influencer or a thought leader. Hey, all good. It's not for everybody. But you personally need to have things out there that have your name on them. And there's ways to do that that are not posting every day on LinkedIn or becoming an, an Instagram diva or whatever. Putting out YouTube videos, uh, Karatika Jane is doing that right now and uh, I'm supporting that, but putting out YouTube videos is one of those. And I do not edit my YouTube videos. I go in one take unless I say something really stupid or just stumble over my words. I, I don't spend a ton of time on content, as you can see. I have a, you know, for like $30 from Walmart lighting setup that's sort of cobbled together with like yeah, I should probably post a picture of my, my setup here. It's, it's comical. Um, I don't spend money on this, so it, it really does not require much. You can go to Walmart and get one of those multicolored uh, ring lights that mounts your phone on it and make videos with that. But anyway, I digress. What we need to do is support each other across platforms. And so I'm using my channel as an example um, but I can go to, uh, let's go to Kratikas. Everybody come to my channel, subscribe, and um, and support the videos. But where's Kratikas? No. No, that's not her. Okay. 
I probably should have set this up a little bit better. All right, let me just show um, if she's posted something recently. Here she is. All right, for the, it's, it's talk Hello, guys, welcome, welcome back to my channel. There we go. Okay, um, so I didn't like this one yet. She just put this out the other day. So w what we can do is go, you know, come to my channel, click like on the videos, drop a comment on the videos. Um, it doesn't need to be anything spectacular. The YouTube algorithm is not the same as the LinkedIn algorithm where it's like, oh, thou must have an eight word response in order to have it register as a thoughtful. It's, it's nothing like that. I mean, you can put great post on the, or, or great video on YouTube and it it's good, it counts as a comment. So let's go ahead and do that. Great video, Karabka. You are going. Okay, so that didn't take long. Um, you know, it's not a massive time investment. Let me go ahead and like my own comment. I mean, that's kind of d bag stuff, but following using. Okay, um, and that's a super short video. I mean, it's a 30 second video right there. Three websites where you can build your portfolio. Okay, so she's got, she's got a little learning to do on uh, getting those titles a little bit more catchy, but um, that's someone that's, she's an individual user. She's a data analyst. She's not, doesn't have a big following yet, but she's out there putting stuff out and she's, she's grinding. She's slowly building something. So I want to support that. Everybody come on to, um, go on my channel, support my videos. I mean, here's one. We're, we're starting to get a couple of hundred views per video for the Tableau challenge, the, the Ultrix challenge, we got up to, yeah, of over 100 for most of the videos, 600 for the first one. So love that, we're closing in on 600 subscribers, support that, cool. Um, so we have kind of a community going with the Tableau challenge with hashtag Tableau Vember. So you can see once you search or you follow a hashtag, you're gonna see that hashtag in recent um, and you're going to see it down here on followed hashtag. So when you go to your home page on LinkedIn, when you scroll down this left side, this is going to be a lot of the things that you access. So you can see I've got three group pages that I'm running um, or three organizational pages, sorry, groups that you're in, recent things that you've gone to, and then followed hashtags down here. So let me click on the Tableau Vember hashtag. When you first get to it, it's going to sort by top. Um, you can change that to most recent. Kathleen's, I think, is the, the number one on both. But you can see, okay, here's some people that, um, that reposted one of my posts. Okay, so I haven't liked Sarah's post yet from a few hours ago. So there we go. Um, and she named me. Oops, yeah, I should have responded to that. Um, okay, yeah, so response to this. Oops. Caps lock. Typing. Oh my god. I'm failing. I'm failing, folks. Zero. Thanks so much for the shout out. And I should have just like typed this before the video and cut and pasted it. Oh well. Someday I'll do uh, show prep, but whatever. Um, happy to see. So again, not, I'm not looking to start massive conversations in Sarah's comments, um, but that comment alone, not only am I responding to her tag, which is going to help her post a little bit, feel bad that I didn't do that yesterday, but um, it's, it's going to, it's going to boost her post uh, just with that. And I'll go ahead and like my own comment. Why not? Okay. Ooh, I'm really, I'm really not doing well. Okay. So supported that one. Cool. Okay. So we're supporting each other on LinkedIn. I've got a group chat going on LinkedIn for people that are doing this challenge. Um, there's still a couple of slots there. If, if a couple more people want to join that group chat, um, we're trying to, to swap tips on Tableau and, and just help each other out in general, talk through the challenge. What are we learning? What are we doing? So awesome there. You can only do 50 in a group chat on LinkedIn. So if we if we get enough and it spills over, I may create a second one. 
Uh, but right now we've got like 47 people in there. So if you want to get in, still time. Okay, so that's it for LinkedIn. Then once you get onto Tableau Public, you're going to go to your, your dashboard on Tableau Public. And so first thing you'll see is Visit the Day. A congratulations to Marillo Kremen for getting Visit the Day honors. Let's go ahead and favorite him. And then um, you scroll down and you'll see recent activity from people you follow. If you're doing the Tableau Vember Challenge, please, uh, people have been posting their Tableau Public accounts. I may encourage everybody to do that today. That's a great idea. Um, and But just go on your dashboard. And so you'll see recent activity. You'll see like the top six most recent. Click on see all. Now it's important you look here. You'll see recent work and favorites from authors you follow. So um, Sarah published this. Archana published this one. Sarah favorited this one. So what you want to do is, is click the star. So you're favoriting vizs that people made. Um, when it says published, if it says favorited, that's somebody else, you know, I'm not connected to Shreya Arya, um, and her iron viz don't, don't care. I mean, it looks, it looks like a very nice visualization. Um, but you know, what I want to do is encourage, you know, if people have published them, then you want to favorite those to get them a little more, uh, juice. So published, favorited, 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 um, so you want to go, you want to go and support the visits of the people that you're following, the people that are in your community. Okay, so there's three quick ways that you can go and support across different platforms on YouTube. Um, like and comment the videos that come out about this challenge. On LinkedIn, go and connect with people that are on the challenge. Go and support each other's challenge-related content, and then on Tableau Public. Go, go follow the other people doing the challenge, like and, uh, and favorite their visas that they put out this month and, and in future. Um, and what you're gonna find is you're building a network of people with a shared bond, um, with a shared interest. And then you've got context, then you've got, then you're kind of invested in each other. And that will produce a productive connection far more often than just sort of firing requests into the void and hoping for the best. All right, let's take that out. The last thing I want to address is I've had three or four people message me in the last couple of days and say, oh, shucks, I missed the, the challenge. Absolutely not. The, um, we are on day four, and that is only for people that, that want to do it during the month of November. You can do... A, an ultra learning challenge anytime. You can compress the, the learning that was required to pass this certification into three weeks, you know, 20 days, whatever. Um, so this thing can last as long or as short as you want. There is still room on the group chat. You can still absolutely catch up on the things that we've been doing so far. All we've done is the Coursera. And if you chose to do so, the Maven Analytics course, which is also available on Udemy for about $13 um, if you get in and get the Udemy discount. So I will, I will post the link for that in this video as well. But absolutely, if you're interested in the Tableau Vember Challenge and you want to join the community, both of those are still wide open for you. Uh, so don't think like you missed the bus just because you didn't happen to see my content. What I would say is I'm going to do more challenges like this. If you, uh, if you are interested in these things, don't let the LinkedIn algorithm decide what you're going to see. Get on my profile, click the, click the uh, notification bell to see every post that I put out. Go subscribe to the YouTube channel, click the notification bell to see every video that I put out. And you'll know well in advance when the next challenge is coming and you can get in and, and join that community. Um, but yeah, absolutely urge everybody, get in on the Tableau Vember Challenge. Focus your learning. Don't just say, well, I want to learn something or I want to do more with this platform and just kind of have it be this hazy thing out there. You need a concrete goal. 
you need it to be, you know, time bound, you need it to be relevant, you need it to be something that, that has an actual, hey, there's a certification at the end of this. Um, so an actual tangible goal, relevant, time bound, all of those uh, smart concepts. So let's, um, yeah, let's, uh, let's get a sense of community, let's get a network, um, and, and let's get something productive out of this month of November, other than just eating turkey at the end of it. All right. Thanks, folks. Um, appreciate you uh, hanging with me today and talking about this semi-related Tableau subject. And with that, I think there's nothing left to say other than stick with me, folks, and I'll make you a genuine Tableau hero just like